Hey, how you guys doing out there? It's me, Elric, and the Dog Buddy coming to you guys live from my living room from the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel. And a lot of you guys have been asking, why do I got a fire burning? You know, well, actually, it's been really cold and rainy here in California. Believe it or not, sunny California ain't so damn sunny. Dogs get impatient. So what are we doing here today on my Saturday when I should be out just screwing around? Well, today we're going to bring you guys something brand new from the people over at Cooler Master. This is their new CM Storm Trigger keyboard now this thing features the highest gold cherry mx switches now these are the cherry mx brown which means they have medium resistance this thing also has five programmable macro keys some really cool stuff you guys see what features right here it also has 64 kilobyte macro keyboard profile memory some pretty good stuff and also this thing's a totally mechanical keyboard as well so I know the dogs get impatient, and you're possibly getting impatient. So let's hop right in and let's see what comes inside this box of the new CM Storm Trigger. <laughs> So here we see the outside of the box. We've got the Cooler Master logo, CM Storm Trigger, mechanical gaming keyboard. I talked about this stuff in the intro. The camera wants to get a close-up right here. I'll move this closer. This is the Cherry MX Brown. Now, the Cherry MX Brown has medium click feedback. Now, some of these Cherry keys, you click them down, they make a full click, 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 click. This one doesn't do that. This one has a mild click. I actually prefer this more. We'll flip it around real quick, show you guys the back of the box. Five fully programmable macro keys, dual USB hub with five volt DC jack. 64 kilobyte macro and keyboard profile memory. So you get memory right on board the thing. So right here's a little box. Get the camera to get a close up right here on the old trusty knife. Now that I have my trusty knife out, I'm going to go ahead and make a quick incision here. Kids don't try this at home. I am a doctor. I'm qualified to do this. So I've made my first insertion there. I will throw the knife at the cameraman. No, that wouldn't be cool, huh? That'd be mean. All right, so here we go. We're gonna pop the cap and voila. Right off the bat on top, we see there is a correction notice. Correction notice. Okay, it says that it's the red LED backlight with four modes. Up to five brightness settings with DC power attached cable. Now that we've got past the correction notice, let's begin the actual unboxing. Got a couple more things here. We've seen this in other products. This is where you can get all your drivers and stuff or updates. Give that information. Go ahead and put that out of the way. Here is the quick start guide. Lots of stuff in here. Not gonna go all the way through it, but just you know, show you guys what it is. It is what it is. It's in a bunch of languages and it basically just explains the keyboard in more detail if you wanna know. Go ahead and get that out of the way. We'll take this, set it out. The cameraman likes effects. I like effects. I'm gonna take the box right here and the box be on its way. Ooh, nice sound effects there. Gotta love that shit, baby. All right, so we got the gold-plated cable right here. Go ahead and open this up. Let you guys check this out. Bada bing. And on the other side, somewhere in here, is gonna be the bada boom. The bada boom is buried inside here. Oh, there you go. So we got the bada bing, and then we got the bada boom. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bing, bada boom. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, moving along. Now we're finally getting to it. We're getting to the keyboard. Dun, 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 dun. All right. So there's the keyboard in front of it. I'm going to go ahead and take this little side panel thing off. Remove the other one. Get that out. So here's our little hand guard right here. Go ahead and pop this thing on first just to get a full look of it. Alrighty then. So let's set the keyboard down. So the cameraman can reposition and get it some nice shots of this. Right here, you can see there's a CM Storm logo. This is going to light up. All the keys on here actually light up. So we'll go across right here. Here are all the programmable five keys we talked about, your macros. Those are all right here. You can see the clicky clicky. It's a mild clicky clicky. It's not a full It does make some clicking sounds. I like a little bit. I'm sure it has full N key rollover as well, being the type of keyboard that it is. Surprised they weren't pushing that because I'm sure that it has it. All your F keys up here. You've got your keypad and all your stuff over here. It actually feels really good. I like just messing around this. It feels really good. All the fingers. I will kill you. Oh. 
<laughs> and I'm gonna move it around and show you guys the back of the keyboard. Here are the two USB ports we talked about. Here's where the plug goes in and then plugs into your system. And here is that DC voltage power that we were talking about earlier, this keyboard had on it as well. So you can see a side angle of the keyboard. We can clearly see the CM Storm logo up there on the top, followed below by the keypad. Go ahead and just move across slowly while the camera's got a nice clean and focus. So you guys can just see some nice close-ups of this as I move it by. So that's it. I hope you guys like it. Here at Tech of Tomorrow, we're taking a look at the CM Storm Trigger Mechanical Gaming Keyboard with lots of great features. This keyboard is going to be hitting the market at about $125, and you guys will be able to get it at Amazon and other places like that out in your shopping world. So we'll see you back here on Tech of Tomorrow later. Hostas.